what is up guys welcome back to the channel today i've got a fun video because i haven't done one of these in such a long time and wow it's crazy how long it's been since i've done this but yeah basically i'm gonna be setting up my binder for we eyes comeback and i only collect Donkan, so i only will be setting up for his cards um but yeah the last video i did preparing for a comeback was mc and d and i'm pretty sure that was like at the beginning of like last year or something like that i'm not entirely too sure maybe sometime in the summer which still it's a long time so i'm just really excited because i haven't done binder videos in general on this channel in a minute um i did film like a, a storing photo card video but depending on whether this one gets um uploaded first i think this one's gonna be uploaded first just because i want to get um this out ahead of their comeback which by the way their comeback as i'm currently filming this is tomorrow i believe um so yeah we'll see how how well I do in terms of getting this video out. Um, after I film this, I will try to edit it as best as I can and make it look pretty and then upload it and hopefully that'll be that, but sometimes it doesn't work out that way. Life is not that easy, but I will try my absolute best. But yeah, basically, I am going to be setting up for Dohan's comeback. There was probably all over the place. Um, I think I jumped from topic to topic, but honestly, it's whatever. The point is, we are setting up for uh, We Eyes Comeback, so let's just hop right into it, I guess. Okay, first things first, uh, we have to make the fillers. So I have like this little piece of note paper, a notepad, that I wrote down all of the inclusions, which there is a lot more inclusions than there was for their debut album. So last time around, they had six photo cards per or they had three photo cards or no for their debut they had three photo cards per album so a total of six photo cards plus two of the polaroids and then they also got came with two different versions of the album which also meant two different versions of the postcards so this time there's three albums so there's double the amount of photo cards and just a whole bunch more inclusions than last time which is absolutely no biggie right like we can get through this it took me quite a long time i'm still not finished with their debut album um i have one polaroid to get left and i do have to get his like um like other dark version it's like the darker one that's like a tan color and then like a dark version of the postcard i still need to get that one as well but i don't really count that as completing the collection really i just need one of his polaroids and then i will have completed his collection because i have secured all of his other photo cards they're just coming um in trades um but i just haven't got them yet also i'm forgetting when their actual debut date was and i believe it was like two three months ago possibly around that timeline um so it's i mean that's still quite a lot of time i mean i did make a lot of progress in that time anyway since i'm kind of almost done um so hopefully this one won't take me three months watch it's actually gonna take me like six months to finish this one which that's gonna be absolutely funny but hopefully not anyways so here's all the inclusions so we got three different versions of the postcards per the different version of albums which they have um all version nothing version and challenge version which um the title of the album is identity challenge i also wrote like the color of like the album so like all is red themed and then nothing is blue themed and challenge is like black grayish themed um but yeah uh, like i said three postcards they have three polaroids this time instead of two and then they also added three tickets which is um like a bigger inclusion which those look actually really really cool they kind of remind me of the like um the v live tickets for like um k-pop group concerts that they've been doing or for like the online concerts and stuff so it kind of reminds me of that so that'll be a cool little inclusion and then like i said there's um 12 photo cards per member which four different photo cards per version and then we also get three transparent pcs which we've never gotten before like i said we have so many more inclusions this time around um and not only did they um add a lot more other things to collect for us they also included these like special inclusions and i put here in parentheses if we're lucky so these inclusions are like limited so there's a golden ticket and there's only six available and they're going to be distributed through all of the albums so honestly whoever gets this you better not sell it watch i totally see people selling that for like 200 
$100, I don't know. I just see that happening because of its limited things. That is just always the case. And then other than that, they also have another Polaroid, which I believe this one is going to be an actual Polaroid instead of like the Polaroids that we got for the last album which I'll show you later in here if you haven't seen it, but it's not like an actual Polaroid, you know what I mean? I think these ones are actually where they've taken a picture from an actual Polaroid camera, if that makes sense. But yeah, they're first press and then there's only 120 available. So the chances are still very slim, but it's a lot better odds than one of six, if that makes sense. So yeah, we shall see if I am lucky enough, but I don't think I'm gonna be lucky, hence if we're lucky. Okay, so those are all the inclusions. Now I need to make my fillers. So here's my fillers here. And then let's see, how many do we need? So there's three Polaroids and there's 12 photo cards. So that's 15 plus three transparent cards. So it'll be 18. So I need to get 18 sleeves, which I do have like my sleeve these are all like the sleeves fillers that i have um i don't think i have 18 of these holographic ones is it one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven yeah nowhere close to having 18 of these so i think what i'm gonna have to do is pull out the pink ones and i know that this does not these are mainly used to my girl group binder um and it does not go with the theme of this album especially with the red the blue and the black so it's not gonna look that great but this is what we're gonna have to work with and i will change them later because i'm thinking about getting um more sleeves um eventually but i just haven't gotten around to it because i didn't really like need it up until this point so anyways for now we're just gonna use these so let's grab 18 one two one two three four five six seven eight One, two, three. Okay, so there's 18. And then I think I'll use like the black ones like for fillers when we set up how it's gonna look. But I'll take that out like in a second. Let's put that off to the side. Oh, they're about to fall. Oh my goodness. Okay, then here I also have like my little um, sticky notes. So I'm just gonna choose which ones I wanna use. I wish I had like, are, are white sticky notes like a thing? I really wish they were a thing and they were sold at our local stores. Um, but currently I have not seen any. Maybe if I look on Amazon or something like that, I really need to take a trip to Daiso to get some more um, supplies to make everything look cute, but I just haven't been able to. But yeah, I think I'm gonna just use pink because right now we're using- <gasps> Fail. I will fix that in a second. Um, but we're using um, pink sleeves, so I think just pink and pink for now is gonna look okay. I don't know. It's not gonna look really cute. I wish it would be aesthetic, but right now I just don't have the supplies to make it aesthetic. So we're just gonna work with what we've got. Anyways. We'll put that off to the side and now i also was thinking because i have these like pens like i could just use my regular black pen which i love this pen by the way um but i do have these like um colorful glitter pens and i was thinking that i would use these to write down on the sticky tabs so let's see the color theme is red blue and black so i do have a black or this is blue what am I saying? I have a blue, I have a red, and then I also have this black one, but this one is like, if you can see, is hella running out. So um, if this runs out, I'll just end up using this black one, but I think I wanna use these to write down. That way it's more cohesive because if I don't end up changing these fillers, then I just know where each photo card is gonna go, if that makes sense. So yeah, I think I'm gonna use these. Okay, so let me put this right here and oh, We've got a little dirty. Let's clean that off. Okay, first let's start with the Polaroid. So there's three of these. We're gonna take three of these. And then what I'm thinking of doing is putting like, I'm gonna write for the Polaroids. I'm actually gonna write just black, just so I can kind of like split it up. And the other, for the actual photo cards, I'll use the glitter pens. But for the Polaroids, I think what I'm gonna do, so I'm gonna write, Donghan's name 
and sorry if my handwriting looks absolutely disgusting i absolutely despise my handwriting and every time i try and practice it just does not get better but hopefully it doesn't bother anybody but yeah i'm gonna write dong han's name and i think i'm gonna write pola like how should i write it so pola and then should i put all version i think i'm gonna do that so i'm gonna put all version in all caps because why not oh my god that looks absolutely ugly but no it's totally fine it's it'll do for now okay so we'll go ahead and put them on okay so there's one it's not centered oh my god i'll fix that later but let's just continue so donghan um pola and then we're gonna do um nothing version I don't even think did i even say what versions they were did i tell you guys i'm not entirely sure but yeah there's nothing version okay let me put that off to the side first and then do the next one sorry my glasses hit the tripod and then this one will be challenge version oh no that's lowercase but it's okay we'll deal with it <laughs> Oh my goodness, it's gonna bug me later, but you know what? It's whatever. I gotta deal with it. Okay, so there's the Polaroid. So let's put them in order. So nothing. Oh, so there's the Polaroid. So we put that right there. And then next, let's do the like, transparent photo card. So that's gonna be three of them. And we're also gonna write it down. So, so yeah, I think I'm gonna do the same thing. Um, but put Donghan and then TP. Oh, not TP. That's gonna look funny. <laughs> nah, F it because transparent PCs is too long to write out. So I'm just gonna put TP. <laughs> oh, that's gonna be funny. Anyways, so I'm just gonna write that down. Okay, so I went ahead and finished them, and then I actually ended up changing- Wait, so I was gonna say that I ended up writing in all caps, but I only did it for this one, and then this one I totally messed up. Oh my gosh, guys. This is me. This is why it's hard to film these types of videos, because it's hard for me to concentrate, and stuff like this happens. These are three different handwritings. Oh my goodness. It's okay. It's nothing to trip over, because- these are going to be coming out soon anyways they're just fillers they're just fillers they don't have to be perfect um but anyways okay so then we're done with that now let's do the actual photo card so this is gonna be a lot guys so hopefully i don't mess up i think for this one i'm just gonna do a time lapse because if i try to fill on the space i'm gonna end up messing up so bad so i'm gonna just do a time lapse for this Thank you. 
All right, so we've got all of our fillers done. There were a few minor mistakes here and there, but I think we did okay. I think I did okay. Anyways, so here are all of them, and now we can start to put them in the binder. Also, I forgot to mention, I'm not actually going to make fillers for these because there's no guarantee I'm going to get them. And if I do make fillers for them and I don't end up getting them when I get my albums, then it'll make me sad. Um, so I'm not making inclusions for that. And then I don't actually have um, any like single pockets for the postcards. And if they're as big as the postcards from the, their last album, then yeah, I'm going to have to use the single pockets because I don't have two pockets. I need to get more like binder pages or sleeve thingies. I don't know exactly what they're called, but tech. Um, but I just haven't gotten around to getting those as well, which I really need to do. Um, that'll be next on my list. But yeah, I'm not going to make anything for the postcards. And actually, I forgot about the tickets. So I need to make a filler for the tickets. So let me do that off camera real quick. Okay, so I flipped open to my Dohan section and I ended up writing um, the fillers for the tickets. I just put ticket number one, ticket number two, and ticket number three in the respective colors. And I'm not going to put like the pink holographic sleeves because... I didn't really feel the need to put them on the holographic sleeve so I'm just gonna go on like this um and then so flip uh, this is my first sight section um like I said I'm almost done I have these three cards on the way even though there's no fillers for them at the moment and I do need his other version of his postcard um so if anyone has or not postcard his Polaroid if anyone has his other version of his Polaroid please let me know I will kindly buy it from you i will kindly buy it from me or i have like a ton of photo cards on my trade and sales account plug at putty minchams the same name as my channel name which i totally didn't have not even addressed on my channel really the fact that i changed my channel name from three souls to uh potty minchams which is not really like that big of a deal i mean it's different branding but i haven't even mentioned it in a single video but until now so yeah i changed my name to potty minchams if you didn't know i went by a different channel name before this current one but this one just fits more but yeah the point is potty mentions on instagram trades and sales account um hit me up for trades and sales and the one don't on polaroid that i need all right so let's move on to the next one so this is also my um don't Han solos photo card section um so we're gonna put the um identity challenge version before his solos so i need to get some pockets and nine pockets here's the nine pocket sleeves and we need two of these because like i said there are double the inclusions this time so we need two pages because i'm not gonna fit all in one um so i have that and then i also actually for the tickets um, I was going to use these for the postcards, but I think they're going to be a lot bigger than this. They're going to need a um, one pocket page. Um, so I was thinking I would just use these for the tickets instead because I feel like the tickets would fit. Hopefully they do. I really think that they will though. So I don't know though if I want to put them in front of um, the photo cards or behind it because I did put his bigger inclusions in the front of the photo cards right here because it came with the bookmark and like these um accordion book thingies um so i did put these here and they fit here so i'm trying to see i think that's what we're gonna do so photo cards and then bigger inclusions so that means i'm gonna put this uh oh this came out so i'm gonna put this sleeve for the tickets right here and uh oh this is all out of whack okay so there's that and then so we can go ahead and label this since this is where the tickets are gonna go so let's see i'm gonna put ticket one and ticket two right here and then ticket three so there we go i think that's kind of evenish looks okay so there's that and then now we have to go and see how we want to set up the photo cards so how would i want to do this because there are 12 photo cards and then there are four cards per version so that means i can have i can either do six per page or but i also have the three versions of the polaroids and the three versions of the transparent cards so how do i want to do this oh my goodness my brain can't handle this okay okay after some thought what I was thinking 
that I do is do the Polaroid and the transparent card and then since there's four photo cards per album and they're all like one color i think the photo cards are actually like different colored back so it's like different colors of red so red pink like white and like another ish color which i think the backs are just gonna look really really pretty so i'm thinking that i do so again the polaroid and then the transparent card and then two of the red versions there and then two of the red versions here and then I put like fillers here and then I do the same for the nothing version and then I do the same for the challenge version. So then I would need three, three nine pocket pages. Should I do it like that? Let's like, let's test it out. Let's see how that works. And then if I don't like it, we'll figure something else out. But for now, let's see how that works out. Okay, so that means I need to get one more nine pocket so give me a sec all right so there's that actually that actually works out pretty darn perfectly if i do say so myself i think i quite like that i think it'll look really really nice like once i get all the cards and then especially the back since the colors are going to be like different versions of red different versions of blue and different versions of black oh actually this slaps this slaps this actually slaps um compared to like you know just the black back and the white back they're gonna look extra pretty and then yeah if i do end up getting by some miracle the golden ticket and one of the polaroids then i'll probably do like a two pocket and put the ticket here and then the polaroid right here because they're the special ones you know what i mean um but yeah other than that i think that's it for my Donghan wee eye first sight or no identity challenge um comeback setup for the comeback oh my god that was a really badly put together sentence i do apologize but yeah that will be it for me hopefully you enjoyed this video even though it was quite a mess but yeah if you did end up liking it give me a big thumbs up so that way you let me know that you did in fact like it and i will do more videos like this because i don't really do videos like this because they're kind of stressful for me but if you guys do like them then i will do more of these types of videos for y'all but yeah, anyways, um, get hyped for their comeback. You better stream and look out for my reaction because you know it's coming. Um, but yeah, that's it. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.